So Roy Lee, he, he passed away recently. Yeah, uh, he got uh, yeah he got shot trying to uh, get a deposit for a show. Uh, he was with his son. He had a son with him. Mm. Uh, somebody walked up and shot him through the car. Oh, he was sitting in the car when it happened. With his son. With yeah. his son. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. When did you first hear about it? Right then and there. I went to the hospital. Oh, okay. So as soon as it happened? I went to the hospital. You went to the hospital and seen him? Yeah. Was he, uh, I mean, was he in bad condition or was it looking like he was going to make it? Yeah, he was good. He was good? He was straight. He was good. And so then it just, things just went bad and he didn't make it? Yeah. Damn. How long was he in the hospital before? Before he passed away? A couple of days. A couple of days? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. He didn't, he didn't die in the hospital. He, uh, he got out the hospital. He got back on his, he started moving around. He was back doing his shows and shit. He was taking his medicine, he had a blood clot. Died from a blood clot. Oh, yeah. oh, wow. Wow, that's rough, man. So he was actually recovering and everything. Yeah, he was moving around. Yeah, my dog moving around. Man. Oh man. So how did how did that affect affect you when he passed away? Fuck me up. I can't still can't believe my nigga dead. You know, you're a comedian. Right. You shoot no comedian. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that that's that's definitely not something You don't hear about that, you man. Know? You, don't hear, you don't hear about comedians getting shot, man. Yeah, you hear you hear about them, you know, talking about each other for fun, but yeah. you never expect like a comedian to get shot, man. Yeah. That's that's uh that's some crazy stuff, man. Mm -hmm. In your song that you just released, it says uh you heard somebody put money on your head. Is that uh yeah, man, I heard crazy stuff all the time, man. You got money on my head and stuff, man, for what? Are those, so those are the type of rumors you're hearing? Yeah, I just hear this type of stuff every day, man. I hear I got money on my head. I hear I'm going to get killed. I hear all type of shit, man, you know? I just hear, it's normal to me, though. Like, I'm numb to it. I hear it so much. It's just like, you know, I had to, I had to rap about it. I had to say something about it. I, I hear it so much. Like, it's crazy, you know? What made you uh, write that or uh, say that line? Is that uh, is death something that you you think about a lot? I don't think about death, but you know, I think about death. You think about a lot of stuff in life. You get what I'm saying? I think about I think about stuff that I don't even need to be thinking about. Like you get what I'm saying? So it's like it, it passes my mind a, a lot of times. You know, when you got people trying to target you, and when you a target, and when you got a you got so many people that's that hate you and hate your success and, and hate where you done came from and yeah man it like death gonna pop up in your head because you know that's how it's basically how it always ends you know you got people who be up here and it's like they ready to bring them down in any form or fashion they can and you know death be one of them so like yeah I think about it a lot you know yeah I'm not re I'm not saying I'm ready to die I'm on my two packs you know, I'm, Kid, come kill me, I'm ready to die. Like, nah, hell yeah, nah, I got shit to do. I got kids, I got family, you know what I'm saying? We got careers, we got the gang, we trying to turn up and shit. So like, nah, I ain't saying I'm ready to die, shit, you know? I'm just saying, you know, you know, I think about death, cause that's what people wish up on me. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But shout out to all the good rappers in my city. They some real good rappers. Okay. They some real good rappers. Have you personally had any near-death experiences yourself? Uh, a lot of time. Anything you can talk about? Shoot ass. You've been in, been how many shootouts have you been in? Too many. Too many? Like the last one, the last one was it. That uh, Fort Worth the club shooting, that was it. Have you ever been hit by a bullet? No. You said, knock on some wood. Hey, hey, we ain't bragging, see, we blessed. Yeah, no, I ain't never been, I ain't never been hit up, man. I always made it out. What was the closest you've been hit? Uh, or the closest, closest to your body that the bullet came? It's crazy, cause like, oh, I, bullets come close all the time. Like, it's like, I done been 
standing somewhere and sitting somewhere where I'd have been sitting on stairs where niggas do drive-bys in apartments. I'm in the breezeway, and them bullets just turn up the, the stair rails and turn up the concrete. But I'm sitting right there. You get what I'm saying? I'd have been uh, standing up in front of cars and shit, and bullets turn up the cars and whoop the whoop, but I'm still standing there. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never been hit. But the crazy thing is, the closest time I'd ever got shot. My own cousin playing with a gun, shot the goddamn gun and went through the hole through my shirt and grazed my other cousin. So I feel like that's the closest that bitch went. <laughs> the bullet went through my shirt and went to hit my cousin in the ankle, like it grazed his ass. So like, the closest time you actually ever been shot yeah, was actually. Yeah, I'm a goddamn kill for <laughs> So like, yeah, no, but like, nah, we blessed, man, shit, I ain't never had to. I ain't never had to recover from no no bullet no bullet wounds. You know what I'm saying? So So one of the times you were shot at, man, you didn't have a chance to get out of the way. Did you see him coming? A lot of times I don't see him coming. I don't never see him coming really. And then when you do see him coming, it'll be like too late. You know what I'm saying? It'll be it'll be altercations where you just right there and a the nigga just up off the hip and yeah, right there. It's so, just going down that fast. Right there. I mean, the odds of you getting hit by a bullet, you know what I mean? It's got to be pretty high when you're in, you know, multiple life-threatening situations like that, It's like man. a sign, man. It's like God trying to tell me something, man, you know? How, so. how young were you when you first got shot at? About 15. 15? About 15. That's why I told you that right. The game bang come from, you know, that's where the shoot ass jumping outfit, you know, house parties, you know. Right. After school fights, it's, you know, somebody got a burner. Right, yeah. Somebody clutching, yeah. I mean, there's some people who are watching this who've, who've never even been close to being shot at or yeah. anything like that. Did it start to feel normal? At all the times? The first few times, I ain't gonna lie, it, it, it scared the shit out of a nigga. Like, damn, man. Like, nigga just, nigga just walked us down, trying to blow us down. Like, like for the first few times, you just like, if, you're like, damn, nigga, we, we were just running from real live bullets. Like, nigga, nigga just tried to blow us down. And then it's like, once you put yourself in that predicament, like, you get air out, it's normal. Like, they air you out, you go air them out. That's it. Like, when you start to just get get yeah, so get immune to it, it was and, normal. 